up toy fans welcome back to the channel my name is Jessie and I am so excited to be sharing this really fun video with you guys today this video was sponsored by Kika Goods so thank you so much over to Kika Goods for sending us this amazing collection that I know you guys are gonna love to see this one's for all my Beauty and the Beast fans out there today we're gonna be opening Allie's minifigures and these are the Rose Fairyland figures they were sent to us by Kika Goods now Kika Goods also also is giving you guys a discount code. The discount code is Fantoistic. So I will leave Kika Goods information down below along with that promo code if you're interested in getting any of these. But Kika Goods has tons and tons of fun mystery boxes and toys and collectibles that you are not going to want to miss. So be sure to go and check them out after the video. But guys, let's go ahead and get into it. It's mystery time. <laughs> So here is what we are going to be opening today. Again, these are Allie's minifigure brand, Fairy Tale Series 5, and this particular series is called Rose Fairyland. Now, what's interesting about this series is what these are is they're actually kitty cats that are dressed as characters from Beauty and the Beast. So we have Beast. Belle in her yellow dress. We've got Chip, which, oh my gosh, this one is so adorable. So it's a little kitty cat inside of a teacup. We've got Cogsworth, Lumiere, and also Provincial Belle in her blue dress. And then it says six kinds plus one secret. But on the box, the one secret is a rose. So fingers crossed, we're gonna get an entire set. These look very similar to how the Pop Mart figurines might be, so I'm hoping that we're gonna get an entire set. But let's just go ahead and start and see what we got. Okay, all right. So here's the inside of the box. It looks like we do have a card in there, and ooh, we've got some accessories in there as well. Okay, so I'm gonna open this portion and see what we've got. Oh! <gasps> Oh my goodness. Oh wow. These are stunning. Oh my gosh. I have, oh, I just have to say, I just love figurines from China. They are so lovely. We open a lot of Pop Mart figurines over here on the channel. This is the first Allie's mini figurines that we've opened and they are such good quality. So first of all, we have a kitty cat in <laughs> little underpants. <laughs> And this kitty cat is like shiny metallic. Look how beautiful. And look at that little booty crack. Oh my goodness, that is so funny. And then it's got a little teacup topper on its head with a little gold detail. It is winking. And then inside of the teacup, you'll see that there's a place to put their feet. So you can put their feet there and then it leans up towards the front of the teacup. So here we have Chip. And a Chip is inside of the teacup and the teacup has really beautiful detail of gold and also teal little fleur-de-lis patterns which are so beautiful okay this is amazing <laughs> and these are very similar to pop mart figurines because they do come with a specialty card so here is the rose fairyland card and it says ally the foo is what it says on this side and then here is chip and then there's some symbols which i'm assuming is the name of the figurine and then it also comes with a rose fairyland card and then also a qr code I scanned the qr code and it came up with this so i'm not 100 percent sure what this means but i'm what a fun start. I am so impressed by the quality of these. All right, let's go to box number two and see who we've got. Okay, theme pink. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness, we have Kitty Cat Belle. <laughs> She's so cute. Okay, so here is Belle, and her dress has such fun details. It's also ombre, so it's a little bit darker at the bottom, and then it lightens up towards the top of the dress. You can even see some corseting on the front of the dress with some little frills around her hands. And then can we talk about her little face? So she has navy facial features. She's wearing this gorgeous yellow crown. And then look at her little ponytail on the top. Oh my goodness, she's got a little curly cue on the top. And then she is wearing, oh my goodness, look at her little bloomers. 
She's got little bloomers on and yellow pumps. Yes, queen. Okay, and then let's turn her around so you can see the rest of her. And I don't know if this is picking up on camera, but there are little golden details at the bottom of her dress that are little fleur-de-lis patterns. Oh, wow. She's so cute. Okay, this series is pretty awesome. I am so impressed. Oh my gosh. So here is the... Uh, Belle kitty cat card again the same back as the other one and then the QR code as well next Let's move on to number three. Let's see who we've got Okay, oh, I think we've got the beast <gasps> Oh my gosh, it's furry. <gasps> Stop it. Okay. Sorry. I was <laughs> having trouble opening it. Oh my goodness Stop Stop it. Stop. This is insane. Oh, it's got a ponytail. <laughs> He's got a ponytail. Oh my gosh, I'm dying. Okay, okay, okay. <sighs> Compose yourself. Okay. We have Beast. We have a kitty cat as Beast. Look how grumpy, first of all. Those little grumpy eyes. Hilarity. And then the head is all flocked with this like brown flocked material and it's got a little ponytail. <laughs> I just. This steals the show for me. I had no idea that these figurines, this one was gonna be flocked. Very detailed coat, uh, just like in the film. So the coat's got like these really cool white ruffles, gold metallic details. Also the beast is shoeless, which we love. You can also see the little toes, which I love that kind of detail. And then here's the back of the coat. It's actually split in the back with little buttons. And then it's ponytail holders and blue. And check out these epic horns. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we're going to put Belle and Beast at the center of this display. Wowie zowie. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Here's the card and also the QR code for this one. Number four. Alrighty. Let's see who we have. Okay. Oh, yay! We've got Provincial Belle! <laughs> I'm sorry, just like these details are so funny. Okay, so we have Provincial Belle. Provincial Belle is Belle in her blue dress. That's what we like to refer to her as in her provincial life. And then she's got another, that curly cue is epic. But can we talk? She's got a book stuck to her, which we love. She's also got a chicken. Um... <laughs> She's caretaking for her chicken and also reading. You know, you got to you got to be a multitasker in a provincial life. So here she is. It's so cute. She's got little ruffled sleeves, a little collar on her dress, and then the little ruffle at the bottom. Look at her little bloomers and her brown heels. What a precious precious. <laughs> Just look at this chicken. <laughs> I'm obsessed with the chicken. The chicken is everything. Here are the cards to go with that provincial bell. Now we're moving on to number five. We've been doing really good so far, so I'm excited to see who we've got um, and see who we're gonna open next. So here we go. <gasps> wow, oh my goodness. <gasps> Oh my gosh, guys, look, it's, it's Cogsworth. <gasps> guys, look, oh my gosh, okay, I'm, this is such a cool, such a cool series. I am so impressed. So we have Cogsworth. Cogsworth has really fun golden hair, little kitty cat ears. It looks like little mustache that his, his little arms to his clock. He does have a monocle and I want to point out the monocle actually does have a lens in it, which is really neat. And it does have a go, uh, like yellow chain that goes kind of behind his front hair. Then on the inside of his body, he's got a little working um, dangle for his, I don't know what, pendulum, I guess, pendulum? What would you call this? I don't even remember. 
what you would call it, but basically it's a clock, a swinging clock pendulum, and there's little cogs behind it and wheels and such to make it look like a, an actual inside of a traditional clock. And then it says Alley the Fox on the uh, pendulum. So I'm assuming that that is who designed these, which is so fun. He's got little shoulder pads. Is he the coolest? Oh my gosh, that is so neat. Here is the Cogsworth figurine and also the QR code. And then we're moving on already to the back row. Let's see who we have here. Aren't these so cool? I am so impressed with these. I have never seen anything quite like these before. Um, I would love to know if you would like us to open more like this because these are pretty neat. Okay, let's see who we have here. Oh, okay, so we have our first duplicate, so there are duplicates. So, oh, I didn't realize his uh, body kind of, oh, that's so cool. His body does move, so he can articulate, which is really fun. Um, so anyway, I'm gonna put him back in the box, and we're gonna move on to the next one. So there are duplicates in this, which makes sense because there were 10. So let's see who we have here. Oh yes, we have Lumiere. So Lumiere, oh my gosh, so, so cute. Lumiere is my favorite Beauty and the Beast character. But look, he even has little candle hands. Oh my goodness. Okay, so here's Lumiere. He's a red kitty cat with a mustache, which we love. And then he's got a dripping candle that's been melted onto the top of his head. And his little flame is actually see-through which is really cool and then here he is he's got a really fancy outfit with gold metallic details and even his little flames on his hands are see-through as well let's do a boop boop oh my goodness what a precious angel the collar on this is very epic he's got an epically large collar I mean, what a cutie. So we're gonna put him on the Cogsworth shelf. Oh, wow. These are really amazing. Here is the card and also the QR. Now, we actually have collected all six figurines. Now, we are hoping to get the rose. So I'm going to feel... Okay, these all feel pretty heavy. We're gonna go ahead and continue to open them. I'm not sure if we got the rose, but let's try and see. Okay, so this is not the rose. Okay, so we have another Provincial Belle and her chicken. <laughs> so we will put her back in the box. And then next we have... I think we're gonna have, yep, we have another Belle in her yellow dress. And then, last but certainly not least, let's see who we have in this one. We have, oh, we have another chip. So here's the chip uh, card, okay. So we did not end up finishing the collection, but I do think that is okay. Well, we did not end up finishing the collection today. We did not get that rose chase, but my goodness, you guys, aren't these spectacular? I am so impressed. I'm so excited to potentially get more of these types of figurines. I would love to know what you think of this series. Did you like it? What were your first impressions of it? Please let me know down in the comments down below. Let's talk about today's pick. Today's pick for me is gonna go to The Beast because Ponytail, and then also Lumiere because Lumiere is my favorite Beauty and the Beast character. You'll have to let me know down below what your pick of the day is. And also be sure to go and check out Kika Goods. Again, I'm gonna link them down below and be sure to use that promo code FANTOYSTICK to get a percentage off of your total order. Thank you so much for being here. I would love for you to join us and become part of the FANTOYSTICK crew. So be sure to subscribe down below for all sorts of mysteries and collectible unboxings. Thank you again so, so much for being here. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next one. In the meantime, stay fantastic.